So this chick has splayed legs. And this is the wrap my vet did. So it's a piece of foam and the leg goes against the foam on both sides. And then we also wrapped the feet because the toes were starting to, to gnarl up. Um, so we're, it's been a week, we're taking it off. We're gonna see how well he looks, or how good he looks, I know. Hopefully there will be some improvement because he really needs to be in a weaning cage. I know, I know, oh, I know, I know. I know you don't like this. I'm gonna unwrap your legs though. Uh -oh. I know, I know you don't like it. It's okay. Let me get this little piece off. I know, I know it feels funny. There we go. Wrap wrap, vet wrap is nice because it only sticks to itself. So see. So toes are unwrapped, toes look much better. Now it's time to see if his legs actually look better because I really need to move you into the weaning cage because you are ready for a weaning cage. You are too big to be in a brooder. I know. Victoria, can you come unwrap? Sure. Come here. Here, just peel it. It's around and around, okay? Good job. We need the foam because we might need to wrap him again. Okay, so there's his legs. Let's see how you do. Definitely. Oh, all, right, all, right, all right, we need to see how he walks. So take this down. So they're definitely closer. They're not perfect, but it looks like it looks like he might be able to perch. They're close enough, and the toes are good enough. I mean, he'll be. He'll be a special needs bird, but it looks like um, at least he'll be able to perch, which is way better than what he had before. His spine is still crooked, but but uh, this leg is much better. This was like way, way up before. Much better. And you're probably going to start flying soon. All right. 